Elon Musk, renowned tech entrepreneur, recently expressed concerns about a bill being discussed in Congress. This bill aims to control the U.S. access to social media platforms like TikTok, unless they cut ties with certain foreign entities. Musk appreciates the sentiment of Representative Thomas Massey, who expressed worry about the implications of the proposed law. The bill, Massey articulated, could potentially censor not only applications, but also websites and services related to them. Massey suggests the potential ban on TikTok could be a facade for increased control and censorship by the government. Musk agrees with Massey, suggesting that the bill seems more about overarching government control and suppression of free speech than foreign threat. The bill isn't just targeting TikTok, but has larger implications in the sphere of government intervention and freedom of speech. Protecting Americans from Foreign Adversary Controlled Applications Act, the proposed bill, has been backed by bipartisan members of the Congress. If passed, the proposed law would ban U.S. app store access and web hosting services for apps like TikTok, controlled by foreign entities such as ByteDance. The president could possibly categorize certain social media applications as national security threats, if they are under the control of foreign adversaries. Winning the unanimous support of the House Energy and Commerce Committee, the bill is soon to be up for a House floor vote. TikTok warns that implementing this bill would infringe the First Amendment rights of millions of American users. The enforcement of the legislation could also potentially block the development of numerous small businesses that rely heavily on the platform. TikTok rallied its user community to speak out against the potential law, which resulted in a flood of calls to congressional offices. The bill, introduced by Representative Mike Gallagher and Raja Krishnamurthy, could undergo a significant transformation in the legislative landscape. Gallagher defended the proposed law, reiterating it primarily targets foreign-controlled social media platforms, not websites broadly. The proposed law, Gallagher emphasizes, aims at compelling ByteDance to sell TikTok due to potential national security threats. Gallagher ended his defense with a stark choice for TikTok, uphold free expression and security for its users, or ally with the Chinese Communist Party.